The Northwest Shelf was really an act of faith. It was like in 1960, Kennedy saying, we'll put a man on the moon before the end of the decade. That was an act of faith. We're going to find it. We don't know how we're going to get there yet, but we're going to do it. We drilled a 2200 foot section and we found 1100 foot of gas. It was gas three times thicker than the thickest then known in the world. So we knew it was a giant gas reservoir. I was the first person to hear Northwest Shelf Gas and I knew it had changed the history of WA. I remember the budget given to the Northwest project in August 1974 was 250,000 per year and we had to account for every cent. It was incredible for a company like Woodside, who had never really made a dollar, to be talking about building the world's largest gas production facility. It was enormous for a company that had never built a shoebox. It's not going too far to say that the friendships made on the project, compared to people put together in a situation like a war, it was a feeling of belonging, a situation where relationships formed that will last forever. I signed around 634 times that night. The fascinating thing about it, and I've only felt it a few times in my life, it was like the exhilaration of a great play or a great opera. There was a moment of intoxication in the evening, a euphoria. It was a triumphal moment. some letters from Charlie Court saying that he and I were the architects of Western Australia's present prosperity. He said that he provided the water and I provided the energy.
never forget the first time I drove to the bar up in 2008 and saw the Caratha gas plant. It was quite simply out of this world. Even today, that same view is incredible and I can't help but marvel at what the plant represents. It's an amazing opportunity to work on a project the size and scale of the Northwest Shelf with its extensive and remarkable history. West Shelf Project was built upon vision and boldness, governments, partners, buyers and community. And of course Woodside as operator took a leap of faith. Thirty years later we continue to push many of the boundaries in the oil and gas industry and we have the assets, the people and the skills to reset the benchmark for the next 30 years. <laughs>